Hello, good evening to everyone. So, like I said, I'm here to show you samples in how, on how to connect. Okay, simple circuit. So, we start with, first with four resistors. In this case, four bulbs. Okay, and then we gradually increase to eight and then twelve. Okay, so we start first with four resistors, or in this case, guys, bulbs. So, these problems that I'll be connecting, or actually we'll be solving them, uh, is the problems that were done by the first batch. Okay, so for your, the second batch, parang may review pa kayo. Okay, so let's start. We have here four resistors, so let's designate them. This is one, two, three, and four. Okay, so resistor one, two, three, and four. Okay, so we have two resistors in parallel and other two resistors in parallel. But these two connections are connected in series. Okay, so remember, positive side of the battery is yung red. Okay, so always red. Okay, and then negative is black. Okay, so to start with is the positive side of the battery. Ito yung battery, I'll show you later. Okay, kasi pag hindi na lang is connection is nawawala. Okay, so first, ito yung battery mo, positive side of the battery. So ito yun. Going here, magbe-break siya into a parallel circuit. So dalawa sila. So magkakaroon ka ng junction dito. Okay, so let's create a junction. Negative. So as you can see, you have a junction here. Okay, so if we break from positive, it will become two. Okay, the other one wire more. So one will go to R1, and the other one will go to R2. So as pag na siguro if one side is positive, lahat so let's say red dito, positive side at tapas dito, and then paglabas to this your negative side. Okay, so like I said, junction positive and negative, and then positive, positive. Okay. Now, the negative side of the two bulbs, that is black, okay? So, negative side of this resistor or bulb, and the negative side of this one, now it's quite hard to open the grip. Okay, so negative, black, and black. So, the negative sides of the battery or of the resistors, siguro lagyan ko muna sa first problem para maliwanag, positive, negative. Then, pabalik ka dito. This is positive, negative. Positive, negative. So, pagbalik niya, negative, positive. So, I think you can see, no? Positive, positive, positive. Then, negative, negative. Paglabas niya, positive, positive. Negative, negative. Back to negative. Okay. So, now, yun siya, no? Negative, negative. Now, these two, dalawa, negative terminal of the two resistors will again combine to create only one line of connection. So, isa na lang siya. Yan. Okay. So, balik tayo. Good. So, as you can see, negative and negative. Ayun, dalawa negative. Magkikita sila. Yan. So, isang line na lang. So, pag may merge yun, may junction ka naman dito. Okay. Now, this line is this one. Okay. Now, this one, again, another junction. So, this is red. So, black and black. Lagay natin. For you to see na red ang pupunta naman dun sa positive ng other resistors mo. Resistors 3 and 4. Okay. Yan. So, another junction. Okay. So, this junction okay, will be going to resistors 3. Ah, it's quite hard to flip. Okay. 3 and 4. Yan. So, that's a junction. So, the long positive side mo meron na. Yun, the long positive side. Okay? And then, negative side naman nila. Ito, dalawa. Yun, negative and negative. Okay? Negative, that is black. And then, another negative. Black. Okay, so, identify yung mga terminals, no? Positive dito, pasok. Then, negative dun ang labas. Okay? So, ito yung terminal mo. These are the two terminals, okay? One from three. And the other one from four. Mag-merge na naman sila. Okay, so, dito tayo, other junction. Okay, so this junction again will go to the negative side of the battery. Okay, so let's place it on the negative side ng battery natin. So as you can see, all bulbs are lit equal ang liwanag nila. Hopefully, you can see the light. Okay? So, parang ito hindi masyadong maliwanag lang. 
it's because of the camera, yung angle ng camera. Okay? Pero they have equal, okay, uh, luminances, pare-pareho liwanag nila. Bakit ganun? Since, di ba, these two are in series, actually. If you analyze them, naka-series ito, dito. So, meaning they're splitting the voltage. I'm using now 4.5 volts, three batteries kasi yan, okay? So, they're splitting that 4.5 volts dito sa dalawang to. So, this is 2.25 and 2.25 volts sila. Okay, now, alam nyo naman, since parel yan, kung 2.25 to, yung dalawang yan, 2.25, and so on. These two are also have 2.25 volts. Okay, now, if I disconnect R1, okay, pag pinatag ko yung R1, na disconnect yung R1, ibig sabihin, R2, under pa siya, since you still have a complete circuit here. Yan, complete to pa circuit mo dito, no? Ah, red wall pen, red, red, red marker. So, pag nawala to, meron ka pa circuit dyan. Okay, but, Ang mangyayari is, R1, dito sila dalawa, they're splitting the current. Remember, parallel circuit yan, nag-split the current ng 1 at saka 2, nagahati sila sa current. Now, pag nawala yung 1, if 1 is disconnected, therefore, the current that R1 uses will go to R2. So, lalakas ang R2 mo ngayon. And then, ang bawasan itong dalawa, hihina naman yung dalawa mo. Kasi, masosolo ng R2, they're sharing dito pa ng current. But, yung current na nandito is pumunta doon. So, to see kung tama yung circuit, if R1 will be removed, or disconnected, R2 will be brighter and these two will will be dim. So, may parang nalalabo ng content. Okay? So, let's see. Tagalim yung R1. Yun. So, sige. Oh, oh, well, can see. Meron pa silang ilaw, no? Pero malabo na. Okay? Medyo malabo na yung ilaw. Pero meron sila. Meron sila. Uh, yun. Medyo meron pa. Eh, hopefully, you can see them. Pero yun, meron siya. Okay? So, tama yung connection. And to test it another way, if you remove R4, pag R4 tinanggal mo dito, is yung R3 mo naman ang pupunta ang current ng R4 to R3. So, ito naman naliliwanag. This two will be uh, dim. Okay? So, mag-hina mag, uh, naman yung katila. Uh, kasi nag-share pa sila dun sa current. Okay? Pero ito mas nasoro niya na. Okay? So, let's remove R4. This should be brighter. This two will be beyond. Okay? So, as you can see, maliwanag yung 3. Yung dalawa is malabong sila. Okay? Balik to. Okay. Okay. So, pala mo, tama yung circuit ng connection. So, good analyze. Okay? So, bakit ganon? Kasi, sa parallel circuit, nagahati sila ng current. Okay? So, if you remove R1, the current that is uh, flowing through R1 will go to R2. Kung 1 ampere to, 1 ampere to, so, pareho sa 1 ampere, yung pinag-a 2 ampere yan. Pag tinanggal yung R1, magiging 2 ampere to. But, this 2, tingo 1 ampere lang sila. Okay? Kaya, ihina yung utaryo sa kanila. Okay? So, that's the first problem. Hopefully, uh, you understood. Anyway, we'll, we'll do another example for you to understand it better. Okay, uh, let me remove the wires first. So, mas marami. Okay, ah, well, I won't be removing siguro yung junction part para na mahirap na may maglagay. Ah. So, these alligator clips are quite new. Kaya, medyo mahirap silang uh, buksan or i-open. Okay, let's have another problem. Using four resistors lang muna tayo. Okay, let's say... So these problems were the ones solved by the first batch. We'll be changing them for the second batch, but it's a form of a review. Okay, so this is your one, flow, R2, R3, and R4. Okay, that's our second illustration. And it's not quite straight, but hopefully you could understand the illustration, okay? Now, let's start. So, from the battery, okay, so the positive side of the battery, so let's remove another wire, this one. Okay. So, positive side of the battery, okay, red, will go to R1. There. Okay, so that's the first. Positive to R1, okay. Now, R1 here, the negative side of R1, the black part niya, will be creating a junction going to R2 and R3. So, uh, wires, junction, para hindi niya tayo mahirapin to connect. So, yung negative side, 
sorry, it's quite hard to disconnect the thing. So, little test. Okay. So, negative side of R1, uh, there. So, positive side, battery to R1, and then R1, junction. Okay, so one wire turns into two. Okay, so may break siya in the current. Okay, so ito. Then black. And another. There. Okay. So R1 negative going to R2 and R3. Okay. So one wire, red again, positive. Go to R1. This wire. It's hard to open these wires. This alligator clips on. Since they're still tight. There. Okay. So R3 and R2. Okay. So negative side of R1 creates a junction going to R2 and R3. Yeah, R2 and R3. So ito tayo. Then we went here. Then break. So we continue with R3. Negative side of R3 will go to the positive side of R4. Okay, so negative side of R3 here. Okay, so R3 negative will go to the positive side of R4. There. Uh, okay, there. So negative side of R3 is one. You want wire going to R4. Okay, now the negative of R2 and negative of R4 will create another junction. Okay. So the negative side of R2 of okay. and the negative side of R4 okay. negative and negative so ito yung wires nila will be combining again. Okay. There. So they will become one. Okay. So, another wire. This will be for the negative side of the battery. Okay, so it will the negative. So, before I turn it on, as you can see from the figure, R1 dapat ang pinakamaliwanag. So, bakit ganun R1 ang maliwanag? Kasi, siya lang yung may solo dun sa line. I mean, wala siya ka-split. Although, may kahati siya sa voltage kasi naka-series sila, no? So, voltage ito, tsaka voltage na kabuan na to will be the total voltage of one. Five. Pero sa current solo niya, unlike this ones, pag break sila. Okay? Pag break niya, hati itong R2, R3, R4 sa current. And then, dito pa sa R3 and R4, nagkahati pa sila sa voltage since pareho sila naka, naka series sila. No? Series circuit. Kung ito, let's say this is 2 amperes. Let's say, example, this is 2 amperes. So, magpapunta dyan. I'll write it. Try to understand better. Kung 2 amperes to, since they have equal values naman ng resistances, no? So, pag papunta niya dyan, pag break niya, this will become 1 ampere here, and then another 1 ampere here. So, pareho 1 ampere yan. Pero, ang voltage ng 3 at voltage ng 4 ay magahati pa rin kasi naka-series circuit sila. So, the brightest or greatest luminance will be sa 1. Then, second is yung 2. Kasi, 1 ampere siya, wala siya kati sa voltage. But, itong dalawa, since 1 ampere sila pareho, series circuit yan, but, nagahati pa rin sila sa voltage. So, pinakamaliwan na yung 1. Next is yung 2. Uh, I don't think yellow sila, no? but still, tingnan natin. No? Yun. Okay. Hopefully, you can see 1 is brighter than than 2. Okay. Nakikita nyo may liwanag na 2. Okay. So, uh, you can see na hindi naman umandar. Actually, umandar sila. Kaya lang sila nag-illuminate is lumi ilaw kasi kulang na yun na kuha nilang supply ng voltage. Kasi nag-hati pa sa voltage. Okay. Now, to test that, ganito. If I would remove R4, okay, tanggalin ko yung R4, okay, uh, disconnect natin. Ibig sabihin, the voltage of R4 will go to R3. So, ibig sabihin, yung voltage nito R2 na to. Hello, test. Test, right, hello. Okay. So, yung voltage ng R2, wait, sa pero ito na yun. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, hello. Okay, so meaning, pag tinanggal natin yung R4, yung voltage niya will go to R3 kasi dito kati sila. So, in this case, hindi sila makahati. So, ibig sabihin, parang tigisan na lang silang dalawa. So, ano man ang voltage nito at current, yun din ang voltage at current nito. So, meaning, pag pinatay yung 4, R2 and R3 should have equal in luminance. Pareho dapat yung liwanag nila. Kasi pareho sila ng voltage, pareho na sila ng current. At si 
syempre lamang pa rin yung one. Okay, so tagalin ko yung far. Something wrong with the bump. Okay, so, tuloy. So, tama, ano? So, if ever, pagpatay ng 4, yung 3, lalakas. Kasi pupunta yung voltage niya. Tama. Okay, tama. Diba? So, uh, you could comment below, no? Tama, okay. Pag pinta ba yung R4, liliwanag ba yung R3? Dahil lilipat yung voltage na doon. Okay, so, subukan natin, ha? Subukan natin. <clears throat> so, papatay ko yung 4. So, hindi. Hindi nag-on yung 3. Tumiwanag yung 2. O, bakit ba nun? <coughs> dapat, pag pinatay mo yung 4, dapat yung 3 liliwanag. Kasi yung voltage ng 4, nilipat na doon sa 3. Okay, pero hindi siya lumiwanag. Alam mo, nag-is yung 2. Hindi nag-on yung 3. So, bakit ka nun? Okay. So, ano yung analysis? Kasi ganito. So, yung 3 mo, so you could see kung mali yung analysis mo. Okay. So, yung 3 kasi yung 4, naka-series yan. Okay. So, meaning, Pag namatay itong 4, there's no current flowing na dito kasi putol na eh. Pagdating dyan, putol na. Wala nang babalik doon. So, pag namatay yung 4, may sabihin, patay din yung 3. Hindi lilipat yung voltage ng 4 sa 3. Okay, so yun ang analysis niya. So, kung, kung na-analyze mo kanina, yung kinasasabi ko kanina, pag namatay yung 4, lilipat yung voltage niya sa, sa 3. So, di ba? Dapat lilipat. Pero hindi, hindi lilipat. Okay, kasi naka-series yan eh. Okay, so, pag namatay sa series ang isa, di ba, pag series circuit, if one, is one, if one is disconnected, lahat sila is disconnected. Okay. Now, ito. Pag tinanggal yung 2, yun. Okay. So, pag tinanggal lang 2, yung current nito, yung 1 ampere niya, lilipat sa dalawa. Okay. And then, magkakaroon ka ng isang series circuit na tatlo. Okay. Tignan natin. Now, ko ha. If we remove yung R2, Yung R1, R3, R4 mo, series circuit na yan. Okay? So, ibig sabihin, yung ampere na to, na 2 amperes, is pare-pareho na sila. So, pare-pareho na liwanag. Hihina yung 1 kasi dating hati niya sa voltage niya, itong boom ito, which considered as 1 lang. Ngayon, pag tinanggal mo to, dalawa na yung kahati ng R1 mo. Okay? So, ibig sabihin, lalabo to kasi voltage niya mabawasan. Dati kasi isa lang kahati niya, isang boom lang to. When you, when, when you solve for combination circuit, di ba? Pag nag-combine nito, isang resistor lang yun. So, kahati lang ng 1 is isang resistor lang. Pero, pag tinanggal mo yung 2, dalawa na yung kahati niya. So, pag tinanggal natin yung 2, liliwanag itong dalawa kasi yung current nito is lilipat sa kanila and then, yung voltage na may kitat to. So, ihina to, liliwanag yun and they will have equal illuminance. Kasi, series circuit na yun eh. So, same voltage yung paghati nila and then yung current is same pa rin. Okay, that's the analysis. Okay? So, tanggalin ko yung 2, dapat liliwanag itong dalawa, ihina yun. Okay, so tanggalin ko ito. Yun. Is there something wrong with this? Wait. There's something wrong with the receptacle. Naglulos siya. Yun. Okay, ito nag-fit. Yan. Okay, so balik, balikan natin. Balik ko yung 2. Okay. So, kanina, yan. Maliwanag na konti yung 2. Maliwanag yung 1. Diba? So, pag tanggal ko yung 2, Itong dalawa, magsisiris na sila sa 1. So, yung voltage nito ay sumabawas na dahil tatlo siya nag-share, then niliwanag itong dalawa. Kasi yung current nito, lilipat sa kanila. Yun. So, if you can see, pantay-pantay yung liwanag nila. Okay, ang paliwanag is pag matanggal yung 2, okay, yung current ng nasa 2, yung 1 ampere niya, inilipat doon sa dalawa. Kasi nag-share siya ng currents, di ba? Now, yung voltage naman, kanina yung R1, solo niya yung voltage, ang kahati niya isa lang. Parang dalawa lang siya nagahati. Pero pag tinanggal mo to, tatlo na siya nagahati ito sa voltage. So, mabawasan siya ng ilumina sa liwanag. Okay? Kasi mabawasan siya ng voltage. Ito naman dalawa, is maradagan naman yung current nila. So, series circuit naman, papantay-pantay na yung current. O okay, yung uh, ilumina mo, sorry. Okay, balik ko siya. Okay, so, repeat ha. Pag tinanggal natin yung 4, o 3 naman tanggalin natin. Pag tinanggal natin yung 3, tulad nung kanina, patay din ang 4. Kasi, wala ka, na, wala ka ng flow ng current, eh, putol na series circuit to eh, 
circuit pag nasira ang isa, nat sira-sira dito yung unang row natin sa circuit. Okay? So, ayan na, patay lahat. Yung 2 naman lalakas, dalawa na lang sila. Dalawa na lang sila magkasama. Okay? So, ibig sabihin, naghahati sila, hihina ng konti ito. Okay. Take one ito. Okay, sira na. Okay. So, natagalan ng konti. Natagalan siya ng konti. So, bakit ganon? Kaya pag nagkamali ng wiring, So, masyado nagtagal. Ito pala yung bulb. Okay. What's wrong with the connection? Ito siya na. Wait lang. Okay. So, part. Ah, the battery, sorry. Battery. Uh, I'll, I'll show you something. So, so when you go, when we meet this actual, so kindly do this the battery. So, to, Taka na pero naglulus pa rin. We have three batteries here, okay? So, dapat fit sila. So, kung di sila ganito kasi, the, their connections, uh, like this one, let's say, meron pa isang battery. Pag nag-connect ka, so, nag naglulus yung connection nila, so, dapat intact sila, okay? So, kaya pala nag, uh, nag ayaw mag-conti, is naglulus yung connection dito sa kanila. So, na-tighten pa. So, if ever kasi hindi, last, yung last time, uh, naglulus sila, may, may mawag pa ng ganun, okay? So, pag-fit sila ng mabuti. Okay. So, may positive side. Okay. Yan. Okay. So, ito lang. Di ba ka nag-anong one? So, may nililin. I'll switch the bag. Okay. Nakamabundi. Its rating is lower. Okay. So, dapat yung 2.5 volts ang rating natin. Para po din siya tumaliwanan. Yun, kanya lang dapat yan. So, medyo iba yung rating ng bulb na yun. Siya tumababa. Since we're using 4.5 volts dito, ang rating is only 2 volts. So, hindi niya kaya. Baka mabuti. Okay? So, these ones are 2.5 volts ang rating nila. So, kaya. Kasi, nagahati kasi. Kung nag-solo siya, if nag-solo yung bulb mo sa 4.5, siyempre, punti na yung punti niya mo. Sobrang ng voltage. But in this case kasi, 2.5, Kita nyo naman ang 4.5 to, nag-split yan into 2. So, no one is 2.25 volts. So, kaya ba nito? But yung kanina, if you can see, sobrang liwanan siya. Kasi 2 volts lang ang kaya niya. So, no sobrang siya sa limit niya. So, in the long run, mga ilang minutes lang, puti na yung bulb na yun. Okay? So, tuloy. Pag tinanggal ko, is, ito na kung sino, 3, nilipat yung current itong dalawa doon kasi mamatay na yung 4. So, liliwanag na to. Ito naman is mabawasan siya ng voltage. So, magpapantay sila. Ayan, pati. So, if you can see, ha? this one will be brighter. Ito magtitip ng konti. Yun. Kung tinagal natin yun. Okay? So, pag tinagal naman yung 4, oh, eh. Tinagal naman yung 4. Yun. Okay. So, different rating. Okay, this one is the same rating siguro nung kanina. Two, two volts ka, mas maliwanag siya. Pero, if you can see, diliwanag siya, hina isa. Pero dapat, they should have equal luminance, kaso magkaiba ng rating yung bulb. This is 2 volts lang, this is 2.5. So, mas kailangan niya na mas malaking voltage para mas maliwanag siya. Okay, but I think you get the point. Ihina ito, liliwanag yun. Kasi ito, magkaroon siya na mas marami. Yun, voltage. So, hopefully, maliwanag siya. Okay, so these are the questions I'll be asking uh, sa laboratory. Why? Ba't siya umina? Ba't siya lumakas? Ano ba nangyari sa guard? Ano ba nangyari sa voltage? Okay. So next, uh, let's try another problem. Okay. Okay, how do we remove the connections? Muna ulit. So like I said, these alligator clips are new. They hear up silver. Disconnect. Okay. Oh, this one is so hot. 
Kaya nga, uh, when you test, tignan niyo muna yung connection no? kasi baka sumobra siya. Okay, let's say nagkamali ka ng connection, mas maraming voltage yung pupunta doon sa isang resistor mo, bulb mo, na hindi naman niya kaya. Okay. Let's do another one. Okay, so R1, R2, R3, R4. I think this is much simpler than the last example. Okay, so let's start. Okay, so from the positive side of battery, remember by the color coding you is red, okay? From the positive side is meron nakagad junction, okay? So break nakagad siya into two. Okay, yung dalawa nakagad siya break na into two. Okay, so one will go to R1. Yan. Okay. The other one will start to remember pa rin yung number yung color ng season. Ah, it's Okay. Tanda niya pa rin yung number. So, it's 1, 2, 3, 4. It'd be 1, 2, 3, 4. Alam niyo naman kung bakit yan. Okay. So, yan. R1 and R2. Next is your R1 goes to R3. So negative of R1 goes to positive of R3. So negative of R1, negative side, goes to the positive side of R2. Okay, good. Okay. So if ever hindi siya umabot, you could always connect another alligator clip, another wire pala. Okay, kung sa simple lang siya. Okay. Then R2, the negative of R2, goes to the positive side of R4. There. Okay. So, junction R1, R2. Junction R1, R2. Negative R1 goes to positive of R3. Negative R2 goes to positive of R4. Yeah, so, negative R1, positive of R3. Negative R2 goes to the positive of R4. Okay. Now, again, another junction. So, R4 and R. Oh, Nag-on na siya. Since may complete circuit ka na dito. Eh. Okay, may complete circuit ka na dito sa baba. Okay? So, we connect yung R3 to get a complete circuit. Ihina. Wait, I'll, I'll bring back the bulb na kasi... Kasi... So this one has a low, a higher rating, 2.5 volts siya. So ngayon, tumangat is pare-pareho na sila. Okay. So tulad nung kanina ng illustration na tuloy, they're the same. Uh, hopefully you can see it. Dito na lang, dito na lang. So before, yung first, prob yung first problem, or first diagram, this one. So solve natin kanina, we connected them. The circuit. Okay. So ito, Dalawa sila, there are two parallel circuits connected in series. Okay, two parallel connected in series. Ito naman, two series circuits connected in parallel. So, kanina, pareho din yung liwanag nung kanina, kung unang problem. At itong problem na ito. Okay, so, although iba yung connection nila, you could compute na pareho ang magpapuntang current and voltage sa bawat isa. Okay, uh, uh, assuming, assuming, and di ba assuming, totoo naman na, that their, their rating are equal. So, pare-pareho yung resistance value nila or yung wattage nila is pare-pareho ngayon yung dial bulbs to mga ito. Okay, so, syempre kanina, nung meron isang bulb na 2.5 siya, so, yun na iba siya sa, sa tatlo. 
kay mo yung siwala niya. Kung mas mas kailangan niya, mas malaki yung mountain. Okay? In this case, pare-pareho na sila. Okay? So, ang test natin is like this one. Pag pinatay mo yung R1, yan, yung kanina, sabi ko, pag pinatay mo yung R1, niliwala yung R3 kasi yung mountain siya pupunta doon. So, hindi. Okay, test natin yun. No? Kasi pag pinatay mo yung R1, the current that flows here, this line is mapuputol. So, patay din dapat yung R3. And then, dahil walang kahati, yung 2 and 4, wala silang kahati na sa current, kasi split na current, then, no? is niliwala yung 2 and 4. Okay, so pag patay ng 1, 3 should be off also. So, hindi siya handa. And 2 and 4 will be brighter. Kasi nilipat yung current. So, 1 and 3 sa kanila. Okay, so I'll be thinking for this connected one. So, kita nyo, patay din yung 3 and lumiwanag ng konti yung dalawa. Okay, pero konti lang kasi kati pa rin sila. Okay. Next, pag pinatay mo naman yung 4, dapat patay din itong 2 and ito yung dalawa may iwan. So, tama yung circuit natin. Okay, so that's how you analyze yung circuit. Okay, and if, kung tinanong what is the, if, if R1 has a rating of 1 ampere na tumadali sa kanya, of course, sa R3, 1 ampere din kasi isang line lang sila. Ganun din dito. If 1 ampere sa 2, 1 ampere din sa 4. Okay. And if, let's say, sa R1 mo is 1 volt, kung pare-pareho sila, 2 no, volts yung kanwari, so 1 volt to, 1 volt yan, syempre itong dalawa rin is 1 volt, 1 volt. Okay. At dahil pareho lang ang rating nila, but if not, di pa rin 1 volt siya, 1 volt yan. Okay. Pero dahil pare-pareho ang rating ng mga bagos mo, 1 volt. Assuming kasi, 2 volt na is 4.5. Okay, kung sakali lang, nasaktong po siya. Okay, so hopefully maliwanag yung discussion. Uh, we'll, I'll be giving you different diagrams and then we'll start uh, with the uh, second batch for, for our key and for NY is the first batch this coming week. So ito yung gagawin natin. We start with, with four. Uh, I think I showed you the pictures of the activity. We start with four and then uh, we move to eight. Okay, and then before we go to the sensors using uh, the breadboard. Okay, using breadboards. So, natin ito rin yung mga breadboards. And of course, mga ICs natin uh, for touch sensor and light sensor. Okay, so I think that's it. Hopefully, may nag-ask. If, 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 if you're confused with the connection, you could always watch the video again. So, I think that's all. It's getting late. Uh, good evening na lang to everyone. And kindly watch the video.